What's up guys? Got a package from Subi Mods. Electronic boost controller, solenoid, boost control solenoid, fresh intake filter from Subaru Performance, and a Grim Speed battery tie down for, I don't know, extra horsepowers. Uh, got this clown with me. But we're gonna do this uh, one thing at a time, get everything done, get it done quick, and see what 17 pounds of boost feels like instead of the 12 that I have right now. Excited, let's do it. Oh man, it's actually kind of cooked on there. <laughs> Oh, so much power. It's all greasy, it's dude. All pretty. Ooh, it's so pretty. Almost like it was meant to be there. Gotta make sure the letters are lined up where nobody can see them, right? I wonder if this can make my whooshes sound any better. Unboxing, you ready? Dude, it comes with horsepower. The box is empty. Comes with horsepower. <laughs> I'm gonna horsepower the shit out of this box. Boom, style points, dog. And Let's put it on top of it. Why is it taking so long to focus? This thing kind of F's everything up, huh? I'll just leave it. Let's see, this is my battery hold down, holding down my battery. <laughs> yup. Boom. The good stuff. Got the Cobb three port boost control solenoid. There you go. Let's open this up so we can put it in. All right, so we got the solenoid. Vacuum line, a lot of vacuum line. Uh, nuts, bolts, zip ties. Stickers and a card. Thanks, Marty. Nah, dude. All right, so I'm gonna start with uh, the actual solenoid first, dog. All right, so here's the solenoid. This is gonna just take the place of the old stock one back here. It's gonna mount to this bracket, so I have to pull the bracket really quick. All right, 10? Possibly.
all the way down there. Dude. It really might could be. All right. So here's our factory boost solenoid. It's only got two vacuum lines. Let me go ahead and unplug these dudes right now. Because these ones are going to go away. All right. Let me unbolt this, snap this. There we go. Disconnected it. Right here's the factory boost solenoid. Taking that right out, replacing it with this one. Actually, it looks like it's just gonna bolt right in there like that. that one there yeah this line kind of and then the line that goes here to this you can see it from this side right here okay there we go vacuum line that are about that long. Okay, there we go. You can't really see it, but... Oh, let me turn it around so you can read it. that one and it's gonna run just right here and to Pushing the wrong angle. All right, so I got that one in. I'm just gonna follow this one this way. Okay. So about here. Snip it again. Right. And 
then the last one will go here. Got all the vacuum lines hooked up now. There's this nice little diagram on uh, Cobb's website. I'll put it on here because I know a lot of people won't even look at the website. But yeah, sorry, got that in, got it plugged in. Now let me get it bolted in. Somewhere, dude. There it is. All right. go. It's all hooked up. I'll put it where it goes. Sweet. Now we have to tune it. <laughs> Alright, so I got the access port. I already downloaded the tune for the boost solenoid. So, I'm going to go through here, change the map. Let's see. Flashing it to stage two plus electronic boost control solenoid. If you can see that, damn it, helicopter's off. All right. Cool, so we got it flashed. Now we just gotta give it a second to start it up. 